even with its crude construction, questionable ergos by modern standards, and iron sights that are there, I have no trouble keeping this on target. But I would be remiss if I didn't mention that, considering that is one of the uh, things that really stands out about firing this gun. So, back to past me. Well guys, that's the grease gun. Hope you guys enjoyed this as much as I did. I know I got to share a little bit of why this is kind of a special gun for me. Why it's kind of always been a unicorn, you know? I'm happy to have it in my collection. The collection keeps growing more and more every week. And for that, I thank you guys so much for continuing to watch, subscribe, and support the channel. If there's any other historic guns that you would like to see us pick up and shoot, please let me know down in the comments. I do read them every once in a while, no matter how bad it is for my mental health, but that's okay. I appreciate you guys watching to the end, and as always, I will see you sexy YouTube mother lovers in the next video. Thanks. Thanks, Airplane. Thank you so much.